Hey guys, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to manage and uh, create an Apple ID. Okay, so this is going to be used to download apps and do a whole lot of stuff with iCloud um, for your Mac or iPhone or iPad. Anyways, um, let's just get started. You need an email for sure. Um, the first thing that we're actually going to do is go to Google and we're just going to type in this, my Apple ID. From there, you're gonna see this come up so just click on create or just go to Apple okay Apple my Apple ID or just click on create Apple ID so we're just gonna click on that right now if you clicked on my Apple ID you're gonna see this window and from here you can just click on create my Apple ID okay so you're gonna need an email for that so I'm gonna take you quickly very quickly how to create an email if you don't have an email already set up so this is how you do one so we're just gonna go to Hotmail for example and create one so we're just gonna sign up now okay guys so that's it for creating your email so we just created one right now okay uh, for the phone number part you can put any phone number just in case guys that's not my real phone number so don't even try calling that number I don't know whose number that is I just wrote in a random number okay so we're gonna go into creating this thing so we're gonna continue creating our Apple ID now that, now that we have an email Okay guys, so just in case, once again I put in fake information, don't try sending stuff or whatever to those addresses, don't know whose address that's, that is, I just put random stuff there, um, you don't have to put real stuff there either, so don't worry about it, don't, I would recommend never putting on your personal stuff there just yet, only if you purchase something then you have to put in your real information, other than that, don't do it, I don't think you should. So that's my email. Um, I should be getting email from Apple to this email address because I just created one. As you can see, it's very easy. Once you created one, you can start downloading apps and stuff. Um, I'm assuming that's why you guys wanted to see this. I should be getting an email um, from Apple pretty soon saying to confirm something. Um, as you can see here, it says check your email and look for a vacation email from Apple click to verify so we need to click to verify that email okay so it's techindesignhotmail.com now you guys can actually send me emails to that email I will check it once in a while I guess but um that's gonna be later on okay when I create a real email so don't use this one just yet if you wanna send me emails alright so we're just gonna wait a second for it to come so once we got our email from Apple saying verify as you can see right here okay in your email once again in your email just click on verify now just in case if you made a hotmail account it might be at outlook.com so just in case okay so we're just gonna put in our Apple ID just tech and design at outlook Com. and our password is whatever you type in just remember it has to have a capital letter plus um, a number in there somewhere okay okay so we had something go wrong here which is which is fine just reset that okay so it's been verified so right now what we can do to test it out and see if everything's working is go to Apple ID. So once again we're gonna click on manage my Apple ID. Manage your Apple ID. For manage your Apple ID you can do a lot of stuff. You can add devices that you purchased over the time. I'm gonna say not now. Okay, so let's look up here. So there we go and you can see it's verified, it's created, we can start using this for anything iCloud and anything you want. So if you guys have any problems, anything, 
um, from here it's where you can change all your information later on so I'm gonna be changing a lot of stuff actually um, if you guys have any comments questions just write them here below and don't forget to subscribe and rate thank you